buoyancy control with your CCR can be challenging at first. Begin with careful weighting so that you are neutral and not too negative. Your gear might not be trimmed perfectly when you begin your class, but work on establishing a good body position with trim weights on your tanks and inside the counterlung weight pockets. Throughout your class, you'll make small adjustments in weight, improvements in trim, and equipment streamlining until your gear is clean and nothing is dragging. Your wing and dry suit provide buoyancy changes, not breath control. The closed loop merely transfers gas from flexible lungs to flexible counter lungs, leaving buoyancy static throughout your breath cycle. Work on finding minimum loop volume and learn to anticipate changes. When your solenoid fires, or when you manually add oxygen, you may need to exhale a little loop gas first to make room and maintain stability. If you clear your mask or vent gas from the loop, you should expect to drop. It'll take a while, but eventually your buoyancy control will become as intuitive as it was on open circuit scuba.